Hello everyone and welcome back. It's been a while but I wanted to make this um, sort of like personal video just have a chat with you again. It would be lovely if you stay till the end. Just to remind you my name's Inwills and welcome to the In Crowd. I even got that wrong. <laughs> Hello and welcome back. I hope you're all looking good and feeling fine and welcome back to this video that I'm hopefully shooting in 4K. Yes, it's in 4K. Ba, ba, ba. Yeah, we'll maybe leave that. Anyway, I wanted to make a personal video just to bring you up to date with what was happening and what I'm working on at the moment. And before we go any further, if you really enjoy this video or any of the videos on my channel then please consider liking commenting and subscribing to the channel each one takes me ever closer to my dream and if you're feeling very 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 kind press that bell button as well okay then so what have i been up to well i totally utterly confess that i've been lazy yeah i've been lazy i've been we've on lockdown here as you will know and i've been applying my efforts into streaming and to work and my youtube content sadly has gone downhill and this has mean that i have been fluctuating from 706 subscribers back down to 759 up to 760 back down again and it's been going on for weeks and I was suddenly sat here thinking what is happening here and then I suddenly realized the answer was very simple I wasn't producing content anymore I used to produce a video once a week no matter what it was on and that wasn't happening and hence my subscribers suffered coupled with that i got a wake up be call because um, some of my patreons left me and in the feedback their response was um, they choose the both of them chose the option not producing as much content as i thought they would mm. yes and that really gave me a kick yes so I thought, right, so let's do something about this. And so I've been making, I've had some ideas and I'm pushing things forwards and I'm trying to innovate and, you know, move forward in an attempt to produce more content. So what have I been working on? And yes, this is a personal video. So it's one of those, let's try to do it all in one take. Well, two very important things i got two new computers i am now probably the poorest person in the world but my main streaming computer died and thanks to chugga wugga who sorted out a new one for me i'm back up and running with that as well and i have a new imac and i'm trying to learn all the things about premiere pro and everything like that on the imac at the moment so so that's been really good and really a really powerful incentive for me to get on and um, this is my old iMac that is slowly dying every now and again the screen goes black <laughs> and I can't work on it at all so if it suddenly goes black halfway through this video then you will know okay then so what else have I been working on well I'm trying to produce more videos I've gone for rather than long and involved videos i've gone for much shorter videos so i've started up eso bite size again and i'm trying to work on that with character animation which i absolutely adore and i'm trying to make very short succinct videos to a point that i can you know do um, actually create record animate edit put up on youtube within um what once a month as well as doing everything else so i'm trying hard with that i'm trying to um develop some shorter rule videos for mithra so rather than the big rule videos that i normally produce i want to make something that is smaller and yes yeah, something that 
won't take me a lifetime to actually create. I can do it nice and short and to the point. I'm still creating some, um, hopefully some gibbering GM videos, which I really enjoy talking and sharing about my RPG practice and experience and what I um, love to do with our rule set Mithras. So lots of videos coming your way, hopefully, so well worth subscribing. I'm also working a lot with my streaming. I'm actually streaming more times a week than I've ever done before. On Saturday, I on a Saturday, I actually stream for 10 hours, um, which is absolutely amazing. And I adore it. I, I really do. And I actually look forward to Saturday and Sunday when I can stream a lot. Um, somebody pointed out to me, and I'm so very grateful for it, that... You know, I wasn't streaming so much during the week. And so now I stream Monday night, Tuesday night, Thursday and Friday. Wednesday is my night off when I do this. So, you know, streaming is picking up as well. And I'm gaining the benefits from that, you know, as people come back to me over and over again, which is absolutely fantastic. But I, there's some other things on the horizon that I'm working on and some of the things that I've really enjoyed in the past and really want to move forward. I been, I've been using Adobe Spark and I'm a very much of an Adobe fanboy and I saw it and thought, oh, this might be worth using and they have a logo maker in it. And it was when I was looking at the logo maker and entering in the information that I came across my new logo, my new um, saying. And it it came out very well. It's it, My saying is now stay positive. And it's not only a suggestion to us all, but it's also a constant reminder to me. So when I see it on my merch and things like that, it says in will stay positive. And that's a, a almost like an instruction to me. And I've been working on that really hard and, you know, producing some merchandise with it on. So you can go off and have a look if you wish. So that's really changed how I view not only my streaming and my content but also my life in I'm trying to look at things in a much more positive way rather than a negative and in order to echo that I always have my Mithras Matters video um, podcast which is absolutely I love doing absolutely brilliant we're up to episode 21 on that once a month it comes out but I've also started the In Wills Interval and I actually pre-recorded 10 and five episodes, three episodes, sorry, ten, five, three. Yeah, three episodes. And I, I really enjoy doing it. And one of the my last episode that I did was um, called The Benefits of Lockdown. And talking about everything that I've managed to do because of lockdown. And I don't go to, obviously, my local coffee shop as much now, which gives me more time to stream. I've taken up running and go out and run about 5k three times a week. So I wanted to share that, you know, although it's horrible and horrific what's actually happening in the world, I need to look on not necessarily the, the virus, not that at all, but you know, my own personal well-being and what I'm doing and trying to keep positive with that. I've always wanted to write a novel. I always feel that I've got lots of ideas up in my head and lots of imagination, and yet it doesn't really go anywhere. And one of the outlets of this, of course, is my role-playing games, which I adore as a GM creating them. And if you are a member of our Patreon, team then you will know that you can actually now get access on a fantastic site that I will do a video on called World Anvil and all I'm trying to move all the content for um, my campaign um, over to that at the moment so people can share in it and, and read about it but I've also wanted to write um, stories and I've done a few of these and very small vignettes, I call them, very small, only like two pages. And they're always available on my um, my blog, my webpage, inwills.co.uk, for you to 
download. They're downloadable content. They're free. Um, but you can, you know, it's suggested prices a quid if you want it. And what I actually did, somebody commented that I had a voice that might be nice for recording. Um, so you decide, you decide. Somebody once said it was slightly too high pitched, but I, I'm moving on from that, moving on from that. And so I have started to record some of my short stories, my scenes, um, as well as actually writing them. So I'm in the process of recording some of those. So I'm working on that and really I accidentally bought a year subscription to a site called Skillshare and I'm using that a lot to listen to how people should write fiction, um, masters, talk, giving master classes about it. So I'm really enjoying that as well. I've, I've also got trying to do some 4K video, um, which you're hopefully watching now. I have no idea how this is going to work out, but I want to push boundaries. I want to innovate. And I've been watching a lot of videos today about creating um, thumbnails and how to get seen and how to be recognized um, on YouTube. So I'm working really hard on that. I've also, I've always wanted to do pixel art and I noticed a great colleague and friend of my XL cast has started to do it. And I really like the idea of cartoons and um, animation and pixel art. So I've got ideas about that, um, you know, in my head waiting to erupt out of it. I'm going to have to blow my nose. Sorry. Um, and the, the final thing that I wanted to say is that I, as you know, you probably think final, thank goodness for that. Um, I've been an MMO player for quite a time and you might have remembered that I went, I was always um, being like a tank and always kept saying I'm tanking and things like that. And I suddenly came to the understanding that I was actually trying to be something that I wasn't in those classes. And I started to think a lot about what I actually enjoy doing in MMOs and if I was playing role playing games and things like that. And the really interesting thing is that I've actually gone back to what I actually started off with um, in MMOs and, and online games and things like that, which was always either a magic user class or a range class or a pet class. And, you know, I'm really enjoying that. I decided to main an archer in BDO and I've just got up to 56 level, but I'm persevering with it and trying to push myself to the end game rather than starting up another character. Uh, I've started to play Guild Wars 2 and after trying to play melee characters, I've gone with the Ranger and finding it absolutely fantastic, really enjoying it. And I even in um, ESO, I've gone back to an archer class or a magic user class or a pet class or something like that and feel very natural and very comfortable in the um, position and playing that and playing style of that character. So I, I'm really loving um, that as well. So things are going very, very positively at the moment. And I just wanted to make this video to say that I'm on my way back. I'm you know, I've been away for a while. I haven't produced a lot of content, but that time has changed now and I'm going to be increasing my skills. I'm going to be pushing boundaries. I'm going to be in innovative. So, you know, it's well worth you sticking around. And I think it's about time that I lived up to you pressing that sub button and start to provide you with some more content. So, that's all I have to say for this week, but be prepared because I'm on my way back and there's going to be some great things happening here. Well, I think they're great in any case. You may not, but I do. Okay, I will catch you all later. And until then, only remains for me to say, stay positive. See ya. Bye.